British broadcaster ITV received a record number of Ofcom complaints in response to Queen Charlotte branding the royal family's appearance on the balcony of Buckingham Palace as terribly white. A Joa Ando's appearance on ITV's coverage of King Charles III's coronation on Saturday during which she described the moment the royal family waved to thousands of citizens from the balcony of Buckingham Palace for the first time following the crowing of the king as being terribly white received 4,165 complaints from the public. This, according to the Daily Mail, meant that the segment drew the largest number of complaints to the broadcasting regulator Ofcom for the year so far. Despite this, ITV has so far refused to address the moment or the public outrage that has ensued. During the broadcast, Ando, a Ghanaian heritage actress who was born in Bristol, said, We have gone from the rich diversity of the Abbey to a terribly white balcony. I am very struck by that. The actress, who is currently starring in Netflix's Queen Charlotte, a Bridgerton story, which controversially misrepresents Queen Charlotte as having black skin, went on to say, I am also looking at those younger generations and thinking, what are the nuances that they will inhabit when they grow? Andola wasn't the only British leftist to express rage over the British royal family being British, with persistent staple of the legacy media, this is why I resist author Dr. Shola Mose Shogbamimo claiming that the ideology of white supremacy is literally metaphorically and symbolically the bread and butter of British monarchy and superbly exemplified on Buckingham Palace balcony while the multicultural slash multi-ethnic slash multi-racism stay below where they belong. Meanwhile, Dr. Charlotte Proudman went on to complain about the supposed white male privilege displayed by the crowing of King Charles III. Her comments even drew a community notes correction on Twitter, with users pointing out that for 134 of the last 200 years, a woman served as the head of state for the United Kingdom. While ITV has yet to make an apology over the comments broadcast on their airwaves, the Netflix actress who is married to a white man put out a quasi-apology, saying, I think I upset a few people yesterday. I was talking about the day and how marvelous it was and then looking at the balcony at the end and suddenly going, oh it's so white because the day had been so mixed and I didn't mean to upset anybody. It's a bit of me that we've gone from the, uh, the, uh, the rich diversity of the Abbey to a terribly white balcony. I'm very <laughs> struck by yes. that. I'm also looking at those younger generations and thinking, uh, what are the nuances that they will inhabit as they grow? Um, nuances that, that uh, uh, Charles has exhibited from a, 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 you know, a teenage into early 20s year, a young man thinking of the life ahead of him and thinking about the world. But that final wave was absolutely the big uh, gesture of relief. And